Hello everyone, let's look at the steps to set up the user folder name on Windows 11 during the out-of-box experience. Up until now, during the initial setup when creating a new account, the system will use part of your Microsoft account email address to configure your profile folder name. Even though it was quick and convenient, it wasn't an ideal solution. A workaround to this issue was to set up Windows 11 with a local account as you could specify the folder name by using a custom account name. However, Microsoft have now blocked all the most popular bypasses to create a local account during the initial setup. So technically, you can't use this approach anymore. Other tricks you can use include creating a local account from the desktop after the installation using a name that you want for the folder and then transferring all that data to the new account. Even further, you could also modify the registry, but it can cause, but this approach can cause different issues and it is typically not recommended. However, starting with Windows 11 builds 26.220.6772 and 26.120.6772 and high releases, the company has updated the system so you can now use a special setting to set your preferred account folder name during the initial setup. But it is not an option that you will find in the interface. Instead, it's a special command that you have to use by opening command prompt during the out of box experience which is still not ideal for regular people, but usually advanced users are the ones who want this custom configuration. Okay, after installing the operating system, you are going to arrive to the out-of-box experience to complete setting up the installation. So first you need to continue with the out-of-box experience as usual by choosing your region, your keyboard layout. On this page, I will recommend always to set up a computer name that will make it easier to find it in the network and to organize your devices on your Microsoft account. But for now, I'm just going to skip this option. Now, this page is only available on Windows 11 Pro. So here I'm just going to select the set for personal use option, and then I'm going to continue. Now, when you arrive to the sign in page, use the Shift F10 keyboard shortcut, and that will open command prompt. And in here, we're just going to open the OOVE directory using the CD command. And then we're going to use the set default user folder that CMD command, then use one space and then confirm the name that you want to use for the user folder. Now for this video, I'm just going to type this and then I'm going to press enter. And now the built-in script is going to check if that name is valid and then it will confirm that the name you specify has successfully been applied to the user folder. So now we just need to close this and continue with the regular setup of Windows 11. I'm just going to use the default privacy settings just to complete the setup process. I'm going to skip the backup recovery. And now just for the purpose of this video, I'm just going to skip all the remaining steps. Now, after the installation, we can confirm the, the user folder name by going to File Explorer. And then on this PC, let's just go to C and let's go to the user's folder. And you can see that the custom name that we used during the out of box experience has now been applied to the user account. And that's it. That is how you set the user folder name during the initial setup on Windows 11. Let me know in the comments what you think about this new feature and if you plan to use it. And also remember to like the video, share it, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.